ਹਾਈ ਗਾਇਸ ਸਤਿ ਸ੍ਰੀ ਅਕਾਲ ਵੈਰੀ ਵਾਰਮ ਵੈਲਕਮ ਫਰਮ ਟੈਕ ਸੈਵੀ ਪੰਜਾਬੀ ਮੁੰਡਾ ਸੋ ਗਾਇਸ ਆਈ ਹੈਵ ਰਿਸੀਵ ਲੋਟਸ ਆਫ ਰਿਕਵੈਸਟ ਫਰਮ ਮਾਈ ਫਰੈਂਡਸ ਵਿਦ ਰਿਸਪੈਕਟ ਟੂ ਐਮ ਐਸ ਵਰਡ ਫਿਊ ਟ੍ਰੇਨਿੰਗਸ ਸੋ ਇਨ ਥਿਸ ਪਰਟਿਕੂਲਰ ਵੀਡੀਓ ਆਈ ਵਿਲ ਬੀ ਕਵਰਿੰਗ ਥੀਸ ਸੈਵਨ ਟੌਪਿਕਸ ਵਿਚ ਯੂ ਕੈਨ ਸੀ ਔਨ ਦ ਸਕਰੀਨ ਸੋ ਫਰਸਟ ਟੌਪਿਕ ਆਈ ਵਿਲ ਬੀ ਕਵਰਿੰਗ ਦ ਕਵਰ ਪੇਜ ਟੈਂਪਲੇਟਸ ਦੈਨ ਆਈ ਵਿਲ ਬੀ ਕਵਰਿੰਗ ਦ ਟੇਬਲ ਕ੍ਰੀਏਸ਼ਨ ਇਨ ਜਸਟ 5 ਸੈਕਿੰਡਸ ਦੈਨ ਆਈ ਵਿਲ ਬੀ moving ahead with the header and footer training fourth point is uh, deciding the themes to make your document uh, really look amazing uh, fifth topic will be to add some watermarks you know sometimes you have to add uh, create a commercial document so you need to have a, a watermark as well so that people don't copy your uh, template or whatsoever and sixth part will be adding some page borders you know in this document and last topic will be inserting the link okay so without wasting much time let me just start off so i'll just create a new page first topic is cover page okay so on the top left hand side you can see a cl insert option you can just click this one and on the left hand side you can see there's a pages option over here just click it and when you click that a cover page option will open click the drop down button and these are the list of cover pages you can see okay so you can select any one of them let's say i'll select this austin one there we go within two clicks a cover page is created okay so i'll just uh, open in the focus mode so if you can see this this is a cover page so i mean this document looks or like okay we want a little bit more fancy and personal touch to it so we want to add some uh, let's say images uh, in this particular document it's very simple let me show you how to do it so in that particular inset you can see there's a pictures option click that okay this kind of window view open just uh, go to the image wherever you have copied in the desktop let's say mine is here there we go so this is the image i want to add but you can see this image i mean i don't like the placement of it i want it on the top left corner you how to do it i'm trying to drag it but it's not dragging so how to do it is like click the top three option then click the in front of text option okay then you can easily take it any way you want okay just resize the image I I want this white background to go and I want to sync it with the previous background you know the bluish kind of theme how to do it just double click it go to format go to color on the top just they go to drop down select set transparent color select it okay there we go now if I want to change the color of this document simple just double click the background of the document again go to the format okay on top there the shape fill option click that and you can set to any color you want there you go i want a bluish i want a, i mean orange or whatever i'll put any colors i want so just play with it guys this is very simple i mean keep trying don't be scared to try okay perfect so once we are done let let us move to the second topic now uh, which is the table creation in 5 seconds okay perfect now i'll click again open a new document so for that you know you just have to uh, go to insert again there is a table option over here just uh, down click it then you can just uh, select the rows and column let's say i want uh, you know three rows and uh, whatever uh, sorry eight rows and three columns there we go now this looks pretty much bland you know i don't like the look and feel of it now, how to change it quickly just double click it again so again on the design side you can see on the top there's a drop down over here click this and you can see lots of designs over here so i i like something uh, bluish you know so i can add over here so i can just write serial serial number particulars yeah and fina whatever okay so it's very simple i mean uh, within 5 seconds you can just you know add create a table so like this you can change the layout whichever layout you want green blue 
silver whatever okay cool so next topic is regarding headers and footers you know we want a const uh, good uh, header and footer in our document how to do it this uh, easiest option option is you know on the top you can just double click over here yeah and add whatever you want proposal for such and such company okay find my spelling mistake <laughs> okay now you want this uh, this font to be little bit bluish just double click it click the blue option then bold it and you can center line it as well and you can increase the size of the font as well by clicking just over there okay now i also want some uh, my logo to be added over here as well logo i showed you before just go to insert go to picture yeah then go to wherever that uh, particular image is saved add it over here resize it a bit now this is you know just with the text i want it on the top right hand side again just click that option on the top then in front of text resize it a bit drag it to the right there we go that's your brilliant header created now similar to this you know i want to create a footer footer is also very much easy go down and uh, when you can see over here just double click it thank you and again home and middle it let us just uh, increase the size of it again so there we go now we can see on the focus mode our header and footer is also created okay now third topic is regarding the theme theme is very easy you can select the theme uh, from the design option go to the design and there's lots of themes option over here you can see i mean whichever theme you want you know you can just select it uh, if you like bluish kind of theme just select the bluish color and you know we'll get all the kind of bluish fonts and the size of it in headers and everything okay next option is regarding watermarks you know sometimes you are preparing a commercial documents and you want a confidential watermark at the back how to do it let me show you now again uh, you go to design okay then there is a watermark feature on the top right corner just click the drop down button and you can see there's a all there's a ready made confidential written over here just click it there we go confidential will come okay now sometimes you want a uh, i mean custom uh, watermark you want something else to be added it's simple again click the drop down button just go to the custom watermark section and uh, instead of uh, confidential let's say hello text savvy and uh, yeah we can just uh, change the fonts and you know size it change the size as well so you can change the color as well let's say blue and just click apply and click okay that's it there we go hello text savvy watermark is added as well okay so you can just play with it you know it's very very easy it's not not very tough you know next point is with respect to page borders okay so this is very important you know, sometimes you want a flashy page border you know at the corners of this particular document how to do it on top right of this watermark you know there's a page border section just click it okay select uh, any of the design you want let's say i want a box design in page border section so now this is a thin line you know i want a bit more thicker line let's go down there we go select this kind of a line yeah you can change the color as well if i if you want a bluish kind of line i'm very much fond to this blue color that's why i use it very much and just click okay there we go so you can see these borders are created in in your document it looks pretty pretty amazing you know when you prepare a doc document yeah okay so uh, next and last uh, topic is regarding inserting links you know how to do it sometimes you have to insert few links in your document and you uh, you don't have much data to add on so how to do it again 
go to insert option again this is a pretty much very useful uh, tab this one then you can see over here it's a links option is over here go to links click the link again and you can add anything let's say i want to add uh, uh, let's follow up and updates kind of uh, link and it will just uh, check the exact uh, link and image of that particular section and it will add it over here okay it's taking a little bit time over here for me to add there we go <laughs> okay so now the link, link is added as well okay generally it doesn't take that much time i don't know why it took it but it's okay now sometimes you know you want to add some uh, more kind of links or some pictures as well you know uh, that as well can be done so i will cover that in the next video so in this these were the seven steps you know wanted to show you with respect to uh, you know uh, ms word so so i hope you guys uh, loved this video and uh, keep sharing it i'll come up with with more you know ms word uh, tricks in my further sessions uh, you know as per the request i'll be preparing these videos so thank you so much this is karan sharma signing off thank you bye bye